Back now in Most Buffalo with a very important reminder. One week from today is February 2nd, Groundhog Day. That's when Puxatawney Phil makes his prediction of whether we will see six more weeks of winter or if spring will come early. But more importantly, Buffalo Groundhog Day is tomorrow with Buffalo Burt. Buffalo Burt's still sleeping, but we have Buffalo Mac. We also have Jared and Andrew from the Buffalo Groundhog Day Society. And Buxtony Phil and his crew, they're kind of intimidated by what's going on who's here that? in Buffalo. <laughs> uh, Lauren, who, is, who, who do you speak we of? We don't have to say his name again. Uh, well, All right. that, that is the, uh, that's the rodent we don't really need to okay, speak of. Okay, we don't acknowledge him. Really, um, Buffalo Groundhog Day is Groundhog Day. We've been doing this for 11 years now, and it's the best party in Buffalo. It's the number one winter fest. In fact, two years ago, we won a national award. Woohoo! Yeah, right here. We won. Oh, there we go. Yeah. We won this right award. Here. So that's the good news, Lauren. The bad news is, and we had a blast last year. We had a huge crowd. It's a fun time. You know, yeah. um, Buffalo Burt comes out. Everyone gets excited. The energy in the tent's ridiculous. Again, we're at Flying Bison every year. We have a big heated tent. We have Hocus Pocus, our own house family polka band. We also have No Vacancy, which is also our family band. And I mean, but the only thing was, is last year, maybe it was the weather, maybe it was not, we didn't get that award. Okay. So what that mm. did, that just lit a fire under us, mm -hmm. right there, Mac? Look at Bert. there it he is. lit and, and basically lit a fire under us. And now we're gonna make this year's Buffalo Groundhog Day the biggest, the best, more beer, more fun, more music, more food. Yes. What else, Andy? And the weather is 50 degrees because it's always 50 degrees and Buffalo Groundhog Day. And I don't Can't care. Argue with I, that. And the weather, the meteorologist may say it's a little bit colder, but in my heart and with my thermometer, I'm going to say. It's going to be 50 degrees on Buffalo Groundhog Day tomorrow at 12 o'clock at Flying Bison Brewing Company. And that's when Bert will come out to look for his shadow? It will come out around 2 o'clock. Okay. We have a nice beer barrel where he hibernates. And then when it's time, we knock on the barrel, we wake him up, and he'll come out and we'll have, a, have our prediction. And by the way, he's the most accurate, and most accurate groundhog. <laughs> most accurate, actually. I mean, there's a lot of great Usually, meteorologists around, and Jennifer, I know, is right there. Yes. But... <laughs> Bert kind of gives everyone a little run for their money. And he usually you know? predicts six more weeks of winter. That's typically well, we don't know. his prediction. Lauren, we don't. You don't know, but. Yeah. But in the past. In the past, he, but regardless of that, <laughs> we have to remember that he is the most accurate. Mm -hmm. um, also, too, we're going to have food tomorrow. We're going to oh, have absolutely. lots of food truck. Um, Buffalo Pizza Kitchen's going to be there. Yes, uh, Moon Doggies, mm -hmm. as well as uh, House of Munch. Great food options, uh, great beer options at Flying Bison. Of course, we couldn't do this without our title sponsor, Pasquale Piquico PC, No Fault Solutions. They make it happen, and we, have, we just need everyone to be there to celebrate and to celebrate winter and to celebrate the new, uh, new season, hopefully. You can get tickets ahead of time or at the door, and some of the proceeds go to help animals like all Buffalo Bert and yeah. his yeah. mother, Mac, who's yeah. joining us right exactly. now. Exactly. So basically, all, all the proceeds go, we've been doing this for 11 years, uh, all the proceeds go to help animals in Western New York. Um, it's a blast, and we just can't wait. We need everyone to go there. If you buy a ticket online on buffalogroundhogday.com, it's $25 tonight, uh, 30 bucks at the door. Mm -hmm. So, and, and of course, you can always make donations to help your favorite local animal charity which we've been we've been having a blast. Some of the ones you partner with are we got Hawk Creek, mm -hmm. of course. That's one of our title, and that's uh, where benefits. Bert lives. And, and actually, some of the yeah. and that's where that's where Bert lives. <laughs> but also some of uh, some of the pet um, mm -hmm. rescue groups here. Um, we've sent um, money even to Australia to, during the wildfires. I mean, we no animal needs that is in need is out of our radar. Buffalo Groundhog Day, you guys really have a passion for this holiday and you have made it something that is synonymous with Buffalo. So thank you for coming in on the show. Thank you, Mac. And it's time to toss over to meteorologist Jennifer Sinonis. Jen, what do you think about having another weather predictor in the studio right how, now? How fun, right? <laughs> this sounds like such a fun event. Hi, everybody. Hi, Jared. I'm so glad you guys came yeah, into the studio. Uh, I can't believe Groundhog Day is like already almost here, but does mean that we're already almost into February, so we are cruising through winter. So that's